Hello, awesome folks. I hope you're having a great day today. Today, we're taking a look at the next sh short story in this collection, Tales of the Tattooed, uh, which I'll link to you in the comments below. Also, just see if I can find this for you uh, for free since written more than 100 years ago. It's by Saki. It's called The Background. It's four pages long, which is about what you would expect from a Saki story. He's considered a master of the short shorts uh, and so forth and this is really good i liked it a lot uh, it's my favorite short story and this is, it's eclipsing the previous one the tattooer uh and it's now moving into my top short story in there it's about four, it's about eight pages long uh four pages longer rather and i'm going to be giving this an eight out of ten to it was great stuff now saki was considered a master of short short stories during his era in this time uh, he died in world war one uh, and with the with the last words on his mouth being sh t telling a comrade to, to turn off uh, to turn off their cigarette that they had l that they had lit off until it to extinguish it and then he was snipered and killed in trench warfare even even though he was an older man by that time he was um, he had biting criticism for the culture's wars of that day but he was actually pretty conservative uh, compared to some other writers he was pro british he was pro colonial stuff uh, he was kind of jingoistic at times he was fighting the good cause in world war one right he was uh, against women's voting and, and the women's mo movement and such so he was kind of conservative in a lot of ways uh, and yet he had this 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 strong anti-establishment bite to him too that he's, that he's definitely well known for uh, so this is again called the background I'll keep my views spoiler free and it's, it didn't even take me like 10 minutes for me to knock it out last yesterday so I won't take too much of your time on it either uh, for you folks but I definitely liked this short story I thought it was a lot of fun uh, stuff basically on the first page uh, we're going to find out uh, that there is this guy. Uh, he has just, and he's from uh, Belgium, and he has just inherited some money, but not a lot of money. And although he's poor, so it's a lot more money than you would have expected, and so forth, from a, from a from a, from a distant relative that didn't have anybody else, and so forth. And now he's spending it. Uh, and on page two, we'll find out he wants to spend on a tattoo called the background of the self-titled part, and he also the tattoo. Uh, but what ends up happening? And so forth. What's this tattoo? Uh, who's the art uh, artist, right? And how does this end up being this biting, uh, satirical look at the era, at the Moors of the era? I think it's very, very interesting. So I hope you'll, I hope you'll check it out. Uh, and so forth. So that's again Saki's is the background and an eight out of ten for you folks. Have you read it? If so, what do you think about it? Let's talk about it in the comments below. If you, if you enjoyed this, why not hit the subscribe button, the like bell. If you're feeling frisky, the bell icon too. And also let your friends know about it too, because that's kind of cool uh, for your folks. And then I just want to pause and take a moment just to thank you so much for taking some time out of your day and investing in watching my video because we all have so many things that are happening in our lives, right? And we're pulled in so many different directions. So the fact that you spent that time with me, that's incredibly humbling. And I appreciate it. So thanks again and have an amazing day.